In the name of Allah, who is most merciful and beneficent, by time indeed mankind is in loss except those who are believed and do good deeds and encourage truth and recommend patience. Good afternoon and a very warm welcome to all the students, parents and Roots family. Assalamu alaikum. Today is a celebration of all that is good about our students, teachers and the school. It is wonderful to observe among you that positive energy that comes on the graduation day. We all are excited about the future for each of our students graduating today. Students, we definitely have the potential to be all you want to be. Thank you for joining Annual Virtual Graduation Ceremony 2020 of Montessori Richmond Campus. Let us now welcome the lady who doesn't need any introduction to Ruth's family for her wisdom, knowledge and hard work, our Honorable Branch Head Mem Akila Salahuddin. I would like to request Mem Akila to please come here and say a few words. Dear students, parents and teachers, it is with immense pride and pleasure that I stand before all of you today. I consider this day to be a defining milestone in the learning journey of our young graduates. I am optimistic that our, that our graduating students would carry their Montessori memories throughout their lives and would look back towards them with joy and pleasure. Our young students are the true engines of prosperity of our nation as they are the ones who would carry the next chapter of the story of Pakistan. As such, there is no better place to invest than in the education of our children. Root School System believes that a child's education should start at the earliest possible age. Considering the importance of Montessori education, we at Richmond Campus have provided the best possible teachers to our young students. And I assure the school parents that at our campus, your child is in safe and highly quality learning environment under the continuous supervision of highly trained teachers. Dear parents, I am highly more optimistic that the future of our young graduates would be bright, safe and fulfilling to the highest degrees. This day marks the end of an entire chapter of the lives of our young graduates. 
Being a mother myself, I can assure you that there is no greater joy for a parent than watching your child in his or her graduation ceremony. I extend my heartiest felicitation to our young Montessori graduates of the year 2020 and a special bow to the parents without whose involvement this success would not have been possible. Above all, I congratulate my Montessori teachers with heartfelt endearment and appreciation for their relentless and extensive efforts throughout the year. As the saying goes, behind every great student, there is an equally great teacher. I am proud of every single one of my Montessori teacher and I hope that together we would be achieving many more milestones in the future. Thank you so very much. Thank you so much ma'am, that was indeed motivating. We are so honoured and privileged to have you among us. Now it's time to take you to the virtual tour of Montessori. Let's see and enjoy what they did the whole year. of RLS, with whose contributions we marvel at our excellence. Yes, our versatile and dynamic head, the CEO Mr. Walid Mushtaq, who has been influential in reshaping and adding paradigm shift to Roots International Schools. His mode of operations is his relentless contribution in enhancing the scale of academics and learning from conventional to technological. He is the think tank of RLS and his unwavering commitment with modern education has earned him international acknowledgements. Now let's listen to the message of Sir Walid Mushtaq. Assalamu alaikum my dear students, parents and teachers. I hope that you're all keeping safe and well and following the right full protocols and provisions uh, to stay healthy and to be engaged. Uh, clearly, as you all know that uh, we were all uh, continuing our normal lives till the month of March 2020 
and when all of a sudden the impact of uh, COVID-19 pandemic took over our lives for the last four months practically. Uh, it has changed the course of the world. It has changed how we see things around us. It has impacted how we live our lives. It has uh, had an impact on 7 billion of the world's population in over 190 countries. And how COVID-19 pandemic has engulfed uh, in, uh, the human population was never seen before, at least in our lifetime. Uh, nonetheless, uh, I take a lot of uh, pride and recognition to the fact that students, parents, particularly since this message has been recorded for our the youngest most uh, population of Roots International schools and colleges students who take admission and enrollments in our nurseries, in our Montessori's, in our daycares, in our early learning, learning centers all across Pakistan. Uh, it is truly going to be a momentous accomplishment for the ones, for those of you who are graduating from uh, Playgroup, progressed onto Junior Montessori's and uh, this year, 2020, will be your graduation year. Uh, well, by the time that you'll be graduating, you'll be really uh, between six to seven years of age. And holding graduation ceremonies for our Montessori graduates has been a, a paramount and an astounding and a unique and a distinct feature at Roots International Schools uh, and Colleges uh, throughout the country. Clearly, as we laid the foundation of uh, education on Maria Montessori methodology of education uh, back 32 years ago in the city of Rawalpindi. Uh, those are the trends, those are the concepts, that, that's the integrated uh, and blended learning approaches. Uh, you know, our teachers and our mentors, our principals and academic coordinators have empowered and have uh, embellished in each one of you. Uh, concepts, uh, conceptualized learning, uh, engaged uh, uh, delivery, uh, practical examples, uh, singing, rhyming, uh, skill set development uh, from artifacts to general knowledge to performance driven uh, approach in classrooms to practical uh, display of uh, sensorial and EPL uh, skills in children's life. I mean these are some of the key distinct features which uh, as parents you must have seen your students would have developed over the last three years of their engagement in our schools. So uh, clearly, I mean, uh, pandemic may have caused challenges, but your institution raced and rushed to extend a moral, social, intrinsic, uh, psychological and behavioral support to thousands, tens of thousands of children in our schools and colleges nationwide. And uh, clearly, I mean, uh, we are at this day where there was an unstoppable uh, means of engagement where our teachers had logged in and uh, where you as students and graduates have been logging in on your learning management system and your, on your virtual classrooms and the learning never stops as we say. So once again clearly it's a, it's a huge day students and I wish you all the best youngest Rootsians this day and opportunity uh, will mark a significant day in your accomplishments and your attainments for future lives to come as you progress on a very critical and a crucial stage of your life from advanced Montessori's into the primary roots, international primary program uh, tiers across the country, across your schools. And our classrooms, our schools are very eager and are excited to welcome you. May those be virtual schools, may those be face-to-face -face learning schools as and when schools we open up. But uh, learning never stops and uh, I wish you all the best. Stay connected. Stay motivated, stay hydrated, stay refreshed and look after your well-being and health. As that is the most important element as we pass through these challenging times. Thank you once again. We think too much and feel too little. More than machinery, we need humanity. More than cleverness, we need kindness. Without these qualities, life will be violent and all will be lost. You, the people, have the power to make this place a beautiful place to live in, to make it a paradise. Let's all pledge to make the world a better place to live and not to commit the mistakes first. Montessori students would like to share their future plans with us. Let's see what they have to say and what they want to do. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Taha Shah. 
I like airplanes. I like flying in the sky. When I grow up, I will take people to different countries in the world. When I grow up, I will be a pilot. Inshallah. Thank you. Assalamualaikum. My name is Delha Shah. I like coloring and painting. I like to draw animals and scenery. When I grow up, I want to be an artist. Thank you. My name is Anayati. I'm a lawyer. I want justice for my clients and help the poor. My client, Muhammad Ali Jinnah, was also a lawyer. I love to be like my guy. Thank you. Hello, my name is Samara. I want to be a footballer. Hi, my name is Amir. I'm a teacher. I'm a future maker of the kids. I'm telling you something. Watch your hand. Watch your feet. He did Thank you. Bye bye. I am a teacher. I teach students. Dear parents and my darling students, the moment we have been waiting for, it's time to recognize the success of our little Montessori graduates. I feel very privileged and honored to stand here in front of you all and acknowledge the achievements of our brilliant students who have made both the school and their parents proud. A big round of applause for all the little shining stars. Ahil Fahad. Congratulations! Mariam Shukeb, very well done! Congratulations, Abu Bakr Siddiq! Fiza Bukhari, very well done! Arush Ahmad, superb! Aiza Mirab, way to go, beta. Congratulations, Shahir Irshad. 
Very well done. Ab brush Asim. Ibrahim Mozam, superb. Madhya Ali, very well done. Filza Mashaim, congratulations. Sayyida Maryam Fatma, you rock. Mohammed Kamil, our little debater, congratulations. Very well done, Zimil Sana. Congratulations. Vahaj Ahmed, you made it. Congratulations. Zaha Fayaz, way to go. Aisha Fatma, well done. Zirva Rashid, you made it. Muhammad Abdullah Atif, congratulations. A leader is the one who lights the path to the impossible and takes those who follow to great heights. It would be an injustice not to have called upon our wings of flight, our pillar of strength, and our constant source of motivation. For the closing remarks, I would like to cordially invite our principal, Mansobi Aline, to join us here. Thank you very much, Farheen. Dear parents, esteemed faculty members, and my very own students, I extend you my heartfelt greetings on today's special occasion. Certainly, it is an important day for all of us as we mark the end of the academic year 2019-20. As an experienced Montessori directress, Montessori trainer and expert in child psychology, I feel proud that despite the challenges and hurdles, we have strained every nerve to provide our students the best possible experience in the classroom. Although the year has been full of unpleasant surprises in terms of the health as well as the economic crisis due to COVID-19. I would still congratulate you on your resilience and perseverance that you all have shown in these testing times. To my dearly loved students, I would extend my heartiest facilitations for the wonderful performance that you have shown and watching these young pupils acquire new skills and unleash their potential has been a treat to my eyes. Dear parents, I understand that watching your young ones graduate to the next class is a timeless experience, which I can totally relate to since I myself a mother to three children. The milestones that your children have achieved during this academic year will be indelibly carved in your children's memory and would have a lasting impact on building their personality. As the principal of RIS Richmond Campus, let me assure you that your children's grooming and development have been my number one priority and I have personally supervised the day-to-day -day learning that took, took place throughout the academic year. I am very grateful to all the parents witnessing today's ceremony for their cooperation and their unconditional support and for not giving up on their children's education in these testing times. Last but not the least, I bow down to the dedicated and industrious teachers who have not just been teachers of these young students, rather their guardian angels, looking after their individual needs and addressing them in the best possible ways. At the end, I would thank you all for your precious time and I hope Almighty Allah will deliver us from this current crisis and soon we would have the pleasure of having our students back in the school. Until then, take care of yourself and your loved ones. Thank you very much. My dear students, the future is where you will spend most of your lives. The real power of creating and being responsible for your own future is unlimited. You will hopefully experience enormous joy in creating this journey for yourself 
and enjoy the benefits of it too. Of course, there will be challenges ahead. However, when you are determined to succeed, you will make the right choices for you. I encourage you to put all your energy, your faith, talent and time into each opportunity that comes your way. Follow your dreams, follow your passion, believe in yourself. Life is an endless process of self-discovery. Good luck and thank you.